I think that traveling during this time is definitely difficult. Um, I'm a college student, so I don't really have much of a choice, but I think that any unnecessary travel should be avoided. I went and got tested two days ago. I'm uh, negative for the third time this year. I'm going to see my family in Chicago, and I'm so excited to go. I'm not sweating it. and just following the rules, and first time I've flown in 18 years. I'm real excited. That makes complete sense. Um, <laughs> I don't know where, well, the thing is, I mean, uh, my family lives in town, so I'm here. I was actually, I used to work at the airport. I was meeting somebody to talk to them about some things. Um, but seeing the airport now, it's about 95% of, of less than what it used to be. It used to be, we wouldn't, we wouldn't be able to stand here and talk. There'd be more people that we'd, we'd be bumped into. So it's good that people are traveling less. I think people should stay home. Um, they should stay well, stay, you know, stay themselves if they can. It gets lonely out there, though. I mean, if you live by yourself, you're by yourself, and it sucks. So, but you can always Zoom. You can always talk to people over the phone. Um, and the Internet's a wonderful thing. Planes are safe. They, you know, they sanitize everything. We have the mask. We have the spray. We have everything, so we're fine. That's it. And we're not taking the mask off. You know, you got to live your life at the end of the day. That's all it is. You can't, you can't just let, you know, these kind of pandemics take over it. You just got to do your necessary stuff and just be safe. That's all you can do. I mean, I do, I do uh, think that they, they have a, a valid reason for it. We have seen an, a spike in the number of cases. Um, but, you know, I think it's all relative to the party that's, you know, um, in the situation. Uh, you know, as we're trying to be safe, masks are very uh, important for all of us, including the kids. So we try to be as safe as possible. lot difference because we are in the middle of a global pandemic and our governor and mayor have asked that if you do not need to travel to stay home but if you do need to travel know that LAX has many measures in place to ensure you can travel safely here. unprecedented due to the global pandemic and it's very difficult to make any predictions on our travel numbers. Last year we had over 3 million people travel through LAX for the Thanksgiving period. This year we know that the airlines have sold half of the amount of seats they sold last year and those people who are showing up to the airport we don't know if they're going to make their flight so we don't know what the prediction will be.